Hello, welcome back to the first burnouts match of the semester. I am so excited to be here. This is uh, Dar, obviously. I am here casting by myself tonight. Uh, very excited to see how today's game plays off for the first burnout match of the semester. You know, really exciting. Last semester, the burnouts, the burnouts pulled off a great performance, although they did not make it. Uh, to the end of the series, they had a great performance, having a great semifinals and a great match over there. And that is something that I'm really excited to see here when we get into these games right now. Now the burnouts are back. Banana Bomb, Nick, Brycey, all of them. Some of them, this might be their last, this is their last semester competing. So let's hope to see if they are going to be able to pull through and maybe get a win this semester. You know, I'm excited just to see some Rocket League just in general. I'm ready. And the game should be getting started any minute now as it is 7 o'clock on the dot. So we are going to get started. I hope everyone is having a great day. <laughs> And I hope everyone is ready to watch some Rocket League, as I am right now. This is going to be a best of five. We are going against um, SIUE University, I think. Um, I might be wrong on if it's not like university or college, um, but we will see. Um, but yeah, we should get into this game any minute now. So just hang tight. Darstan. Thank you, thank you. All right, seems like the enemy team has joined in. And we are about to get started here for some Rocket League, the first match of the semester. Let's get started. All right, pretty good kickoff. Bannabomb trying to go for the aerial, but Cable's going to be able to deny it. Cable trying to set up a shot for his team, almost gets a shot in, but Brycey is going to be there to get the save. Brycey going up for the aerial, going to be able to try and pass it to Nick, but Nick does not connect with Banana Bomb hitting it, but the goal is open on the burnouts field right now. Cable getting the side hit, and Kev gets the first shot of the game, only 15 seconds in. What a great pass all the way to Kev right there. Really well played. All right, we're going to get right back into it. Only four minutes in, 35 seconds left on the clock. Pretty even start right there with Brycey getting a pass with Kev getting a bump on it Brycey gets a backwards hit but Nick is going to be able to unable to connect I'm trying to get the hit Kev almost gets another shot but Nick goes in for the epic save Nick going for the hit but Cable is going to be able to deny it with Kev getting a double tap SISU is putting some pressure on the burnouts right now. Keep getting as many shots as they can. And the burnouts are trying to reciprocate that onto their side, but it doesn't seem like it's working. Great save by Banana Bomb right there. Kev gets an open shot with Brycey missing the save altogether. It's unfortunate right there. But that's just what happens sometimes. Right to the top right corner. And they get a shot right in the first minute. Brycey with just a shot right from the main goal. What a way to get a goal. Now it is currently 1-2. 3.40 left on the clock. Going to go right back into it. You know, gets the pressure with Nick trying to center it out. Nick going up for the second hit. This is going to be able to get through Kev. Going to try and hit it to the side. Pass it to his teammates. But Neo is going to be able to block it. So Brycey cannot score. 
Nick is going for the hit. Banana Mom gets the epic save. Brycey tries to get it out, but Cable is trying to put pressure. Oh, and what a shot by Neo, but it does end up hitting the backboard with another shot by Cable. Brycey's going to be able to get it out. It's right there. It's stressful. Nick gets the demo onto Cable, denying that shot. Nick, keeping it passed. Neo gets the hit, but Nick is going to be able to get there, getting a full three save. Just this match so far. Banana Bomb going for the aerial hit. Nick trying to follow up for it, but Kev is going to be able to hit it midway. The pressure that SISU is just putting on is immense right now for the burnouts. And another shot by Kev, giving him a hat trick. Still got about three minutes left on the clock. The burnouts need two or more goals to tie up and win this first round. See if the burnouts are going to be able to do that. Venom, I'm trying to center out. Gives a shot for Brycey to get it out. Gets the side hit, too. Going to try and center it. Gets it past two of the SISU teams. Nick and Venom, I'm both going to double commit that. You know, going for the shot. Hits the backboard. Unable to connect. Brycey trying to bump Cable out of it, but is unsuccessful. Banana Bomb gets the save, even though Brycey misses it. Neo going back in for the aerial shot with a backboard hit by Cable. With another hit by Kev, the pressure that SISU is putting on this team is just insane right now. And it is really showing against the burnouts. Shot after shot after shot, and it's just it's not looking good. All right, let's get back into it. One to four with only one minute and 45 seconds left for round one. Kev getting a hit. Going to try and get an aerial hit with it, but gets a backboard shot and is unable to connect with Nick. He's trying to center it out. However, Banana Bomb getting it all the way up to the top. Brycey getting the save. Banana Bomb almost connects with it. Nick goes for the center, gets it all the way past half court. Oh, keeps going. Gets the shot. What a great play by Nick right there. All right, two minute, two to four with one minute and 15 seconds left on the clock. Banana Bomb goes up for the top hit. Kev trying to get another hit with Mew. Trying to pressure onto the burnouts right now, but Nick is going to be able to get a save. Cable is unable to connect with Nick. Getting another hit. Trying to pass it to Brycey. Going to be able to pass it mid lane to maybe get a shot right here. Only one minute left on the clock. It's open right now. And Brycey gets another shot, making it 3-4. With about 50 seconds left. What a great shot by Brycey right there. Burnouts need one more goal to tie it up. With only 45 seconds left on the clock, the pressure is rising. It's only round one, but it's still there. Ooh, and Kev gets an aerial hit all the way. What a shot by SISU. SISU is definitely putting up a fight for the burnouts for their first match of the semester. Going to go right back into it. With th It's currently 3-5. to five. With 41 seconds left on the clock. Nick gets a hit. Going to try and get a double tap. But it gets this connected by Cable. Use director cam. Yeah.
and game one is gonna go to SISU. Game one did go to SISU, but it's just starting right now. We are getting right. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. Kev going for the hit right here with Nick. Trying to contest it here. Banner Bomb. Bryce going in for the shot here. Nick is gonna be able to is unable to connect. Four minutes and 20 seconds left on the clock with Banana Bomb. Trying to get a shot here. Neo goes for the shot here. Gets the first goal of round two. Spicy Brycey. Going up for the shot here with Kev trying to get the shot on right now. But Nick almost gets a hit, but it gets to the backboard. Banana Bomb going in for the second shot and is going to be able to connect, making it one to one. What a great shot by Banana Bomb doing it right after Nick's fail. Going to be able to get it. Banana Bomb trying to go for something here. Kev trying to hit it back to his teammates with Nick going for the aerial shot. Going to be able to try and do something here. Neo gets the save on the shot with Brycey going up for the backboard hit. Going to try and connect, but Neo is going to be able to get there. Nick going for the hit. It is open, but Cable is going to be there to save it. Banana Bomb going up for the shot here with Cable. Trying to do something, anything here. Ricey going for the hit. Cable is going to be able to bump Ricey in the wrong direction with Nick getting the center. Trying to get it out of the of their field. SISU just keeps putting incredibly more pressure. Increasingly more pressure. They get another shot. It is now 1-2. Kickoff by Brycey with Banana Bomb going for the center here. Trying to do something. Maybe even get a pass to Nick. Nick is going to be there for the aerial shot. But Cable is going to be there to intercept it. Two minutes and 45 seconds left on the clock. But Brycey getting a great center. And it's almost in. And Banana Bomb gets the shot. It is now 2-2 two to two for the burnouts. It is currently tied up. Two minutes and 40 seconds. What a great... Shot by Brycey, or by an bomb and a great pass by Brycey. We're going to get right back into it. Banana bomb going for the side hit right now with Brycey. Missing the hit right there, but Nick is going to be able to center it all the way into midfield. Almost hitting it in, but it does get saved by Nero. Two minutes and 20 seconds with Nick. Going to be able to counter Nero's shot. With Brycey going for the hit, trying to center it for his team, but it keeps getting bumped away by SIUE. 
Nick tries to hit it, but is unable to connect with an aerial shot. Almost getting in touch here for the burnouts. Banana bomb. Nick trying to do something here with banana bomb. Going up for the hit. Bryce going for the shot here with Nero. Hitting it all the way to the burnout side. Banana bomb is going to be able to there to get the aerial hit. Bryce trying to hit it to the side. But Kev is going to be able to hit it back. Gets a demo on the Brycey. Brycey's brought back to the burnout side. 1 minute and 20 seconds left on the clock. It is tied 2-2. Two to two. Almost gets another shot on Kev. But Nick is going to be able there to save it. Banana Bomb gets the clear all the way back to SIUE's field. Brycey gets the hit. Demo is on to Banana Bomb from Cable with Brycey getting the backboard hit. All we got to do is defend now to get into the first round of overtime or burnouts have to score a goal. The pressure is rising. Banana Bomb going up for a shot here with Brycey. It is fully open but Brycey gets a shot but it does get saved by Nuo. Nick does get demoed by Nuo with only 30 seconds left. The goal is open, and Brycey gets demoed. Ah, what a well-played round by there by SIUE. They were able to demo the burnouts to get that last goal. However, 24 seconds left. There is still time for the burnouts to get another goal and send this round into overtime. So let's see what happens. 20 seconds left on the clock. Nick is going to... Try and get a shot here, but is unable to with Nil pushing it back to the burnout side as fast and far as possible. Five seconds left on the clock. And it seems like game two will be gone to the SIUE almost with a shot. What a close shot right there. Oh my god. Really well played by both teams right there. Really intense game right there with almost a goal at the end of it. It seems like we are going to be getting into game three. It is currently 0-2 with SIUE in the lead. The Burnouts still have a chance in this first match here, but if SIUE wins this next game, it's done. No, gonna go for the aerial hit here. Gonna try and demo it, but Nick is gonna be able to bump that out. But now I'm going for the hit here. Cable almost gets shot on with a save by Nick. Nick going for the shot here, but it almost gets in, but Kev is going to be able to keep it. No, going for the aerial shot. Brycey is going to be there to defend. All of the burnouts will be there. Nick getting a bicycle kick. No, going for the shot. With Brycey almost trying to get the aerial hit, but it's going to go right around it. Nick goes for the center. Is going to be able to get it out of Burnout's field, but Cable is going to be back there with Banana Bomb going for it. Neo going for the backboard hit. With Brycey trying to bump Neo out of his place, but Banana Bomb almost gets a shot, but it gets saved by Cable. Brycey. Brycey gets a shot on by Neo. <laughs> Brycey is going to be able to try and get it to the side. 
with Nick trying to get a center for his team. Banana Bomb is going to be able to miss that bicycle kick with Brycey trying to connect with it. But Neo is going to be able to put so much pressure onto the Burnouts team. Three minutes left on the clock. It is still 0-0. The game is tense right now. Brycey going for the aerial shot here. It's not going to be able to make it with Kev. Trying to get a hit here. But Nick is going to be able to get out of there. Trying to get it out for the Burnouts. And they get the and Cable gets the first shot of round three. Like I said earlier, the pressure that SIUE is just putting on the burnouts is just insane. And it's really showing right here. It's giving the burnouts not enough chances to get it out of the goal and get their own goals. And it is really pressuring them. Bannabomb goes for the hit with two, minute, two minutes and 20 seconds left on the clock. Bannabomb trying to do something, trying to get a goal here. Brycey going for the hit. Gets the side hit. It is to the center. Nick is going to keep it right there, but unsure if it's going to be able to connect into the goal. Bannabomb misses, ending up going to the burnouts field. Spicy Brycey. Going for the backboard shot is going to be able to get it out with Nick getting another tap on it. But Cable and Kev just keep hitting and hitting and getting shots on and pressuring the burnouts. Only 1 minute and 50 seconds left on the clock. It is not looking great for the burnouts. Nero almost gets another shot and then Kev does get another shot making it 0-2 burnouts. You know, those type of shots are just unfortunate in Rocket League, and especially with the pressure that SIUE is putting on the burnouts, it's just it's just inevitable at this point. We're going to get back into it. Pretty standard 50-50 right there with Nick almost getting another shot here. Gets the center, but is going to be able to... But Cable is going to be able to get it out of there. Nick is going to be able to get it centered. Almost going to be able to get centered. Maybe for a goal here. Bryce gets it in. What a great pass and goal by the burnouts right there. Intensely quick with Nick getting the pass and Bryce just getting it in right there. What a great play by the burnouts right there. It is currently 1-2. to two. The burnouts still have a chance to tie up this last game. Banana Bomb hitting it to the backboard. Interesting choice. Almost hits it in himself. But Banana Bomb is going to be able to get it out with the pressure. Nick gets it all the way to SIUE's field. With Brycey trying to follow up. Banana Bomb is not going to be able to connect to the shot he was trying to get for. With Cable. Only one minute left on the clock. Cable is going for the aerial hit. But Nick is going to be able to, to save it. It's going everywhere. Banana Bomb trying to get it out. It keeps getting hit back in and forth and forth. Thirty seconds left on the clock. It is currently one two. The burnouts need to do anything to tie this match up and get it into overtime. Banana bomb misses his connection, but Nick is gonna be able to try and get it out of there from SIU's hands. Gets the aerial hit. It looks like it's open right here. Gets it to the backboard, but Neo is gonna be able to hit it out, passing it to Kev. Banana bomb goes for it. Cable. Trying to do anything, but it ends up going in, and that makes it one to three for the burnouts. And it does not look good with three seconds left. And that's it for the first match of the burnouts. Really intense pressure being put on by SI at UE. And yeah, that's. That's, that's the rest of the match. Thank you guys for watching, um, and we'll see you in the next game.